Dr. Karloff, Dr. Mortis, I have those files you asked for. Hey, what are you doing down here? Wait, no, you can't be down here! No! Ah! I need these columns done by next week Friday. This will take me all week to do. If it would make you feel any better, I'll give some of it to Whitney. I mean, that would help. Along with your paycheck. I can handle it. Good. Thought so. Hey, you wanna know something? Not really. I got invited to Dr. Karloff's castle. Why? I don't know, some miracle time to come right here. Look, this could be your big break. Uh, my work? <sighs> Forget about your work. The boss needs stories. The boss needs these columns done. Do you wanna be stuck behind a desk your whole life? You wanna go out and do something. Let me think about it. Sleep on it. What's this? So, when do we leave? What? For the castle. What made you change your mind? This day. You know what this means? No, and that's exactly why I have to go. I'm a reporter, Borges. I solve mysteries, and that's exactly what this is. Hey, I was just gonna say it sounded like a good story. So, what do you know about this Dr. Karloff guy? Not much, really. Yeah, he wasn't really up to much until very recently. Do tell. Well, he was just working with some pharmaceutical companies until he met Dr. Mortis. Then they started designing some medical drinks. <laughs> Never heard of them. Yeah, that's because they all failed. What makes it different this time? As far as I can tell, nothing. Perfect. Glad to know I might be wasting my time. Well, I'm not going to check out the drinks. I'm going for this. Your obsession with that letter is starting to scare me. Yeah, well, I don't know what it is about it, but something about it is really alluring. The place was built in 1066 and has been around for generations. Why a castle? Pardon? Why do you need a castle for research? That's none of my business. I'll have to ask him. Key. It's in there. Please shut the door, Mr. Borges. How did you... I heard you coming. Who's this? Uh, this is my partner, Stry. Oh. Nice to meet you. It's all mine. I think it that you, uh, find my work fascinating. Well, actually, I'm here for this. What are you inferring? I'm not inferring anything. I just want to know what you know. I apologize for my partner. She forgot what we were actually here for. It's okay. I want to be a scientist in order for curiosity. I can assure you, Mr. Wright, nothing sinister. This is my partner, Dr. Morris, a very prestigious scientist from MIT. I wouldn't say prestigious. Oh, don't be bashful, Mortis. Do you have the serum? You're testing it on yourself? 
I always test myself first, plus paperwork that way. How do you feel, doctor? I'm a little drowsy. No adverse effects after directly taking the serum? Of course there'd be no adverse effects, you fool. When could we expect to see any effects? Not for a couple hours. I wouldn't expect a no-name reporter like yourself to know anything. Listen, I don't care if you're the story of a lifetime. You don't speak to her like that. What are you going to do about it, Four Hayes? I believe I forgot something in the other room. Where do you think you're going to stride? Hey! Nice effort, Four Hayes. You can't kill him. Come on, I can get us out of here. Take this. It'll cure him. It's too late for me. I can't do this alone. I put that letter on your desk. What? Why? I wanted you to come here. So you can have your big break. I'm so sorry. Mortis! Try it out! Mortis! 